with Glenn Marini's Sports Report. Sports coverage you can count on. The Knights have indeed been the kings of the courtyard in recent years. Norwell reeling off double-digit wins in each of the last three seasons. But after a talented group graduated, can this year's squad sustain that level of success? We try and answer that question in ASEAN with your latest Highlight Zone season preview. We've got to grow up quick. We've got a lot of young guys uh, playing in spots they haven't played. We're, we're counting on guys that don't have a lot of Friday night experience. We like them. Um, but they're not really known outside of our program. So we need those guys to mature rather quickly and, uh, and to settle in and be the players that we know that they can be. After going 31-6 and six over the previous three seasons, Norwell will look a bit different this fall, especially on defense, where they return three starters. Uh, I really like our speed. We got a lot of speed on our defense this year, and I really think that helped us a lot. But some of the guys that are really going to help us would be Tim Bonjour, we got two new inside linebackers, Colin Burns and Bischoff. Yep. And then I, I don't know, I'm really excited to see those guys play this year. On the offensive side of the football, the Knights are looking to replace graduated quarterback Leighton Bailey. Right now, Alex Fordick and Drew Graft are battling for that QB1 job. Last year, as a sophomore running back, Graft rushed for over 500 yards. And whoever does wind up taking snaps behind center will play behind an offensive line that's looking to replace two all-conference performers in Brody Bolin, who's now at Bowling Green, and Kyle Zettis, who's now at Taylor. I think we're really underrated. I think we have a lot of guys that maybe aren't very high on the spectrum, but they fight really hard and a lot of grit. It's a really gritty team. Being locked in every single day, we can't take a playoff, can't take a day off because um, we lost a lot of guys and we just have to stay locked in. It's a whole, pretty much a whole new defense and our offense is still kind of built. So I feel like there's a lot of pressure on the offense to keep, keep up with hard work and keep scoring. We like the guys we have in our program. We're not going to ask them to be Brody Bowen or Kyle Zettis. We're going to ask them to be them. And we're going to try to, to call things to their strength and, 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 and run things that allow them to be successful. We've got to tailor what we do as coaches to fit the talent that we have. Norwell opening the season on August 18th at home against Mississinawa. 